what's up guys welcome back to my channel welcome back to another vlog as you guys can already tell this vlog is gonna be a life reset vlog this is like my ultimate reset routine usually i like to do like a weekly reset at least one day during the week when i'll do my laundry i'll clean i'll you know do groceries do the whole thing but i have not been keeping up with that routine for the past few weeks now so i'm going to be dedicating today and tomorrow to pretty much just reset everything around me also probably the biggest reason why i want to do this is because we literally have two less than two months left in this year we're about to go into 2024 <sighs> that's crazy i feel like these next two months are going to be everywhere and crazy with the holidays and everything and with my little reset routine it helps me put my best foot forward because literally everything around me may be crazy like days may be chaotic and crazy but as long as my sheets are washed my skincare is done i'm working out groceries are bought my space is clean at least what i can control is good anyways i'm gonna go make some coffee we're gonna get this day started I've been wearing this sweater for literally less than 15 minutes and I already got a coffee stain on it. Anyways, I just made it to Trader Joe's. Before I was leaving my house though, I got such an exciting little package. I ordered these sunglasses last week. After wanting them for weeks, I literally had my little tab open. I don't even know for how long. I was just like, should I get it? Should I not? They're by the brand called Bonnie Clyde. This is what they look like. They're very like 90s inspired, which I was kind of like hesitant about because I'm like, I don't know how those are going to look on me. I'm obsessed. I'm literally never taking these off. I love them. Anyway, so let's go do some grocery shopping. This vlog is kindly sponsored by Scentbird, so thank you so much to them. If you didn't know, Scentbird is basically a fragrance subscription where you basically choose a designer fragrance to try every single month for $17. I'm sure we can all agree that smelling good is so important. For me, certain perfumes or colognes remind me of certain people. Fragrances create memorable impressions and Scentbird is super, super cool in the way that they make it possible to try different designer perfumes or colognes without having to spend so much money. And because with Scentbird, you can experiment with different fragrances, you can find the fragrance that suits your personality and your style. And you save yourself from spending hundreds of dollars on a full-size bottle. These are the fragrances that I received this month. And with each fragrance, you get a 30-day supply. This perfume right here is from Memoir archives. I also received Be Delicious by DKNY. Oh, this one's definitely my favorite. This one has green apple, grapefruit, cucumber, tuberose, and white woods. And lastly, I received this one called Sakura by Ormond Jane. You guys can use my coupon code Espinoza55 for 55% off your first order. And that actually comes out to a little over $7 for your first month, which is such a good deal. Thank you so much to Semperd for sponsoring this video. And let's get back to the vlog. As I was walking out with my car, I was like reevaluating my life a little bit because I'm like, why did I get so many things? I basically just had zero groceries. Obviously, we got some flowers. I got this little bouquet for my mom. And then I got these roses to put in my room. I got this new dip that I've really been wanting to try. This is uh, everything but the elote. And I got that with an assortment of crackers. I got three of these Cliff energy bars. Sourdough bread, fresh strawberries, some salmon. These tiny pickle looking things are called cornicons. They taste pretty much exactly like a pickle, but they're super, super tiny and crunchy. They are so incredibly good. Every time I make a sandwich or anything, I eat these on the side like I'll take a bite of my sandwich and then I'll eat one of these little cornicons I got some everything bagels. I got a little turkey club wrap their vegetable fried rice with their orange chicken and to have another breakfast option I got these whole grain waffles. These are called teeny tiny tomatoes I'm gonna put these in my eggs some avocados and lastly I got this bottle of wine. It's called cotillion
I have an unhealthy obsession with Grey's Anatomy once again. When I was in high school, I watched up to season 14, but I hadn't rewatched it since. And I started it like less than two weeks ago and I'm on season four now. <laughs> I could not stop watching the show. I also forgot how sad this show is and I'm not even at the sad parts. I'm prepared to watch up to season eight and then I'm done because then it just gets way too sad. I'm gonna go to sleep now and I really want to make the most of tomorrow so I'm thinking of waking up between six and seven so that means no more Grey's Anatomy and I'm gonna go to bed. Okay guys, it is Thursday morning. I've had a really good morning so far. I woke up early. I did some editing for a few hours. I had my breakfast and then I got ready because right now I'm about to do a hot yoga class. I was looking at my comments for my last video and so many of you guys were correcting me, telling me that I said the name of this cup wrong. I thought it was Slim. I don't know how I got it because now that I'm looking at it, I'm like, it's so not, like that's so not the name. It's not Slim, it's SM. One of you guys actually told me it's simple modern simple modern that's the brand of the cup i love it literally since last week that i got it for my first hot yoga class i have probably tripled my water intake since getting this little cup like i fully understand why people carry this around like it's their child now okay let's go I just got so humbled just now. The class was really, really good. Like I really want to keep doing it. There were some yoga poses that I literally couldn't do and I couldn't understand how people were doing them because I was trying to do them and I was just like, my body does not bend that way. I just couldn't understand, but it was really, really good. And it honestly makes me want to come back to get better. I really want to go to a coffee shop right now. So I'm going to do my makeup really, really quick. I'm not going to do anything crazy, but just so I look alive. Okay, makeup is done. Now we're gonna go to a coffee shop. It is barely 7 p.m., but I am so tired that I'm literally ready for bed. I'm gonna take a shower, do my skincare and everything. I'm probably gonna end up watching a few episodes of Grey's and then I will definitely be going to sleep. Mm -hmm. 